Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. We're gonna be doing something different this month. I am experimenting with a new way of budgeting. As most of you may or may not know if you're new here, I get paid once a month at the beginning of each month from my full-time job. And then I leave enough money in my checking account to cover my bills, and then I pulled out the rest of the money to get me through the rest of the month. So after I covered my bills, I have $1,640 left for the month. That's for everything, gas, groceries, eating out, sinking funds, saving funds, all the things, okay? So in this envelope, there should be $1,640. So first, let's go ahead and give that account and I'll explain what we're gonna do with that. Fifty, one hundred, fifty, two hundred, fifty, three hundred, fifty, four hundred, fifty, five hundred, fifty, six hundred, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, one, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, two, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, three, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, four, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, five, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, six, six, twenty, forty, sixty. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200, 210, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 300, 310, 20, 30, 40, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, woo, 95, 100, 105, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. All right. So we have $1,740 counted up. So this is my new bank binder and I'm calling this my bank binder because this is the binder I'm going to put all the money in for the month for myself to stuff. So the first envelope, I'm not sure if you can see it very well, it says bank on it. So this is where the money is going to sit until I stuff it into my week one envelope, my week two envelope, my week three envelope, my week four envelope, a week five envelope if it's a five week month and then I have an extra stuffing envelope as well. So today, I'm going to take the money I pulled from the bank and I'm going to stuff the first two weeks of April and then when I do my cash stuffing, I'm going to pull the money from the week one envelope because I'm going to be stuffing for week one. I hope that makes sense and then as we go on through the month, I'll pull the rest of the money out of my bank envelope in the front and stuff week three and week four. So let's go ahead and I'll get all the nominations we need into week one and week two. Okay, so if your girl did her math right, this should equal four hundred and fifteen dollars. It needs to go into week one for April. 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 310, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 400, 405, 10, and 15. So we'll go ahead and get this stuffed into week one. But you know what, before we do that, I'm gonna go ahead and pull the denominate, same denominations out for week two just to save some time. wanted to go ahead and double check my counting on week one. Now let's make sure week two for April has $415, 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 310, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 95, 400, 405, 10, 15. Perfect. So this $415 is going into week one. This $415 is going to go into week two. And 
and then the rest of the money that is left over is going to go into the front into the bank envelope. Ooh, is she gonna fit in there? Getting all sorts of smooshy. And she fits. Perfect. All right, so there's my bank envelope all stuffed up. I'm gonna go ahead and get us set up for our weekly cash envelope stuffing. Okay, so now that the bank binder's all set up, we're ready to do our first stuffing for the month of April. I'm so excited. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and pull from week one. And this is our week one envelope. This should total $415. So let's go ahead and get this counted up. 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 310, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 95, 400, 405, 10, and 15, which is perfect. Thank you, trusty bank binder. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is go into my wallet. This is a new Etsy find. You guys, I'm in love with this wallet. I will leave it linked down below. It didn't come with the keychain. This is my Kuromi keychain that I just love, but it is a envelope wallet. And no, she this isn't sponsored. She doesn't even know that I'm doing this, but I love it because it's got card slots in the front and then it's super flexible. You can, you know, bend it around and everything and you open this pocket and that's where all the goodies are. So these are my cash envelopes that I got from Pixie Lax planning on Etsy. I'll link her shop in the description box below for you. Two separate shops, by the way. All right, so we're gonna get started with pulling out any extra money that I've got here to pull into my savings challenge. So, coffee has one, two, three, four, five. And then, let's see, nothing's got, household has some money left over. One, two, three, four, five, which is excellent. So that will all go into our savings challenge in a moment. I just want to get the wallet stuffed up first. Blessings isn't going to get anything right this second. Coffee is going to get $20. Okay, and then dining out is going to get $20. And then our fun envelope is going to get $10 for the week. And then gas is going to get 60. And then groceries is going to get 140. Household needs to go first. Did I already do that? Are my envelopes messed up? What did I do? No, that's right. Right, right, okay. <laughs> Mia's tired. Okay, gro groceries is getting 140. So 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 140. Perfect. Household is gonna get 20. Put that in there. And nothing for spending this week. So that's my envelopes all stuffed up. And then they just slide right on in to this back pocket here and they fit beautifully. Then nothing's poking up and that's it. I love this wallet. Okay, anyway, moving on. All right, let's go ahead and get into long-term spending. No, psych. Let's get into the savings challenge first. Okay. So my savings challenge, we're doing pretty well with this. We're gonna stuff $10 from my wallet today, which is great, $5 in, let's see, this envelope and then $5 in this envelope. Hope everybody's doing well out there. Drop me a comment down below, let me know. You know your girl's nosy. And she can't talk and count at the same time, but y'all know that too. All right, so $5 is going into this little envelope. And then one, two, three, four, five. It's 
going into this envelope. That's really great. I haven't been able to stuff two envelopes with savings just from my wallet in a hot minute. So that's great. So they're going to go in here. We'll set that aside. And then we're going to move into the long-term savings binder. No, long-term spending binder. Sorry. Okay, so Buffer is not going to get anything today. Close is going to get 10. I took my daughter out shopping, my youngest, for some shoes and things. So we spent out of here. We've got 20, 40, and 50 now. Okay. And electronics is not going to get stuff, but we'll count it up. And we've got 20, 40 in electronics. Gifts is going to get $5, finally. Yay! Ooh, what did I do there? No, 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 no. There we go. Giving is going to get its usual five. So now giving has 20, 5, 30. Haircuts is going to get 10. I did get my modified pixie cut. I love it, guys. I'm having so much fun with this haircut. I love it. It's so fun. So now we've got $30 there. Uh, Just For Me is finally going to get stuff this week. We're going to put $10 in there. And that's for whatever I want. If I want an extra couple coffees, if I want to, you know, who knows? Something, something extra. My mama's envelope is going to get $5. So now my mom's got 20, 40, 60, 85. And then my on the town envelope is going to get 10. I want to drag one of my mom friends out for drink some week soon. We got 30 bucks in there now. And then my wellness envelope is going to get $10. And so now wellness has ooh, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80. Ah, my goodness. There we go. All right. And now we're going to move over into my sinking fun binder. All right, so birthdays is gonna get $10. And right now we are working on July, so my daughter's birthday. <clears throat> and we've got, we're working on June, July, and August. So we've, but actually, you know what? I need to get better at this. I want to pull the total out though, right? So let's put these in date order first. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September. I'm such a hot mess today. I'm so tired. It's fine. Okay. So January and February and March, that's all done. So there's no money in that envelope. April, May, and June is fully funded, and I believe this is at 100 right now. So we've got 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Yes. That's for my mom's birthday in May. And then we've got... July, August, September, so my daughter's birthday in July. 10, 20, 35, 45, 55. So we have $155 in birthdays. Hopefully I didn't forget to stuff that 10 in there. If I did, we know where we need to come back to. Birthdays has 155. All right, car maintenance is gonna get $20 usual. All right. And we've got placeholders in here now because we were all, you know, hot and bothered last time putting money in the bank, which I'm glad that I did because I don't like to have that kind of money in the house, especially with a bank binder now. 
So we've got 100, 200, 250, 270 in car maintenance. Okay, so someone asked in my last video what envelopes I have in here. So these are all of our long-term savings envelopes that I just haven't organized. <clears throat> so in here I've got my kiddos zombie apocalypse envelope. This is just, you know, just a fun name for an envelope for their long-term savings. I have our emergency fund and then my savings envelope. So our emergency fund is going to get $10 this week. So now our emergency fund has 100, 200, 350 in the bank, 360. And I'm going to go ahead and count up the kiddos envelope and include that in that total. That's what I wanted to do last week that I didn't do. They've got 10, 20, 35. And you know, you know come on now. So that's $3.95. Perfect. Yes, and I'm still hiding my daughter's Roblox gift card in here. Don't tell her. <laughs> okay, holidays is not going to get stuffed. I actually need to reimburse myself some money out of this envelope for Easter. Um, so we've got 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75. Yes, I do need to reimburse. No, I don't. Wait a minute, let me think about this. No, no, I don't. 20, 40, 50, 65, 75. I ended up using a gift card. So yay. Okay. Mia's envelopes. We're going to go ahead and total these envelopes up, even though they're not getting stuffed today. Because I want to make sure I always know how much I have in these cat not well in the categories together in the bank. So taxes is a big one. Taxes for Mia's envelopes has 100, 200, 300, 420. It's a lot for me. <laughs> it's a lot for me. Maybe not for some other people, but. All right, 420 in the bank. Giveaways has 25. Products has 5, 10, 15. Let's see, shipping has $30. Yes, it's still in there, guys, because I have products I need to list on Etsy. I just haven't had any time. And Bills has 20. I'm going to need to pull that money out of there. So in Mia's envelopes, we have $510. And yes, I'm in my Harry Potter jammies. It's late. I'm tired. Moving is going to get $10 today. All right, and moving has 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 510, 15, 20, 520, moving. That's right, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 500, 510, 15, 20, yeah, okay. Summer activities for the kids is going to get $5. And I just want to make sure that's the only envelope out of these that I'm stuffing right now. I don't have any money hiding anywhere else. Nothing in school supplies. This one is going to turn into the picture fund. Thank you to whoever recommended that for me. Miscellaneous is empty. Okay. So summer activities for the kids. Here we go. 100, 200, 300, 350 in the bank, 355, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90. Okay, 390. 
and summer activities, which is good. I mean, we've got swimming lessons, day camps, you know, like everything is so expensive. All right, vacation is gonna get $20. Oh, my envelopes are so persnickety. All right, right now we're working on the plane. So we've got 50, 70, 90, 100, 105, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. That's exciting. 140. And it looks like I've got $10 left. So where did I miss a five, you guys? Well, if you notice, hit me up in the comment section down below and let me know. I do have $5 allocated. I'm going to leave this over here <clears throat> because I made a mistake somewhere. I just can't quite figure out where. All right. So there's that. You guys let me know and I'll fix that. And then we've got $5 going into our savings challenge box. We're doing so good. We've only got a few left. Well, not a few, a handful, but that's all good. Oh, I don't want a boring one. Oh, neon flamingos. That's much better. Okay. $5 into the savings challenge. And we aren't going to know how much is in there until we stuff all those envelopes and count it up. All right, guys, that's all I've got for you today. Thank you so much for being here and stuffing envelopes with me. I appreciate you guys, and I will see you in the next video.